Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are jumping right into this video. I hope you get some awesome motivation from today's video. My house was a complete wreck. Everything was just destroyed. There was food everywhere. The floors were really gross. Um, the kids had breakfast and lunch and there were just all kinds of things everywhere. So we've been really struggling with trying to keep the house clean since we've been on quarantine and homeschooling and just having everybody home. It's just been a struggle. And I was particularly struggling on this week, um, trying to adjust to all of these new changes. Um, so I decided that I was just gonna get this house cleaned. Having a clean house just really helps lower my stress levels. I feel like that's probably for everybody. It just makes me think clearer and it helps, you know, keep that aggravation level down low. And this week we were just, it was just like trying to jump into school and we were really struggling with like all the websites and the papers and the books and just everything. It was just an adjustment. So. Um, I decided, I was like, you know what? I am not gonna be stressed anymore. I'm just gonna take three hours and I'm gonna get this house cleaned. And I asked um, everybody to just, you know, either help with me or try to stay out of the way. Uh, and that's what I did. And I felt so much better after I did it and it just made life a lot easier. So I started in the, this is like our new school room. So I just started in there trying to get things organized and put away and um, kind of make sense of it. Cause as you could see, there were just, <laughs> there were just the kids schoolwork all over the table. So there's stuff like all over the floor because when I'm trying to do schoolwork with the boys, I also have to do it with Penelope and I also have to keep Mona entertained. So 
I just sometimes let them draw on the floor and Penelope would do her letters and her shapes and all that stuff in her school paperwork with us and then when she's done she'll color with Mona sometimes and then of course I'm starting a load of laundry I always try to start this whenever I'm cleaning so um, by the time I'm done it's ready to be folded which that would be nice if I actually sat down and folded it <laughs> sometimes I do sometimes I just don't get to it I have a nice little stockpile of snacks for the kids in our like hallway closet and I'm just kind of refilling things and organizing it and making it a little neater. Sometimes when their hands get in there they get um, messy, especially Mona is able to get to all this so uh, if she wants a snack she'll go in there and grab like 10 things and throw them at me. So I just wanted to get things stocked back up and then reorganized. And as you can see, I kind of have things separated into different baskets and some baskets they are allowed to have at certain points of the day. Um, so if you have kids, you know that they basically tell you they're hungry all day long and they want a snack all day long. And one way that we have eliminated that, we have set times during the day that they can have snacks. Um, because Chris and I found that we were just... They, they were just getting snacks all day when they were home. And I'm, one day we we're just like, we know you're not eating this many snacks at school, you know. So we set a 10 o'clock and a 3 o'clock snack period for them so they can have snacks. So they have breakfast and then 10 o'clock snack and then they have lunch at 12. And then at 3 they have a snack. Um, occasionally we'll give them an extra snack if they're saying like they're really hungry. I have a special snack bucket that has like fruits and apple sauces and more of the healthy variety snacks for them to have so if they really truly are hungry they can either have a vegetable from I mean not a vegetable a fruit from the refrigerator or they can have a like fruit cup from the basket in the snack cabinet. So I would love to know what you guys are doing to kind of make this time period a little fun for your kids. Um, one thing that I have been doing is whenever I go shopping, I buy like a box of brownie mix or cupcakes or homemade, not homemade cookies, but like the mix, the cookie mix. And I've just been making them for the kids. Um, it makes them really happy. It makes them excited. And things are a little more stressful sometimes just because all of us are in the house and the kids sometimes they just fight like they're not getting that break from each other that they normally get during the school day so I think there's been a little bit more bickering so I'm just trying to keep peace in the house and that's one thing that I've been doing that um, I don't know it just makes them happy and it makes them excited um, 
and it's so easy you know like those boxes are like 99 cents at the store and they literally take like five minutes to whip up put them in the oven for a few minutes and then they have a nice homemade homemade with air quotes <laughs> treat And if you guys are not subscribed, I would love it if you subscribe to my channel, um, find me on Instagram, and I've also started a Facebook page, which is new for you guys, and I've got that linked in my channel description. Um, you can see that, or I'll link it down below as well. So if you guys wanna check me out over on Facebook, definitely do that. Um, and I just wanna tell you guys that I appreciate all of you watching my videos and sharing my videos and liking my videos. It just, it really helps me out a lot and I am just so thankful for all of you. Even if you try you wouldn't understand it. Maybe something's missing inside of you. Just a bit of sugar to that heart bitter. Maybe you taste different. Hold up, hold up, baby. I can't sit beside you while you're going on about your simple life nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different It never hit you Our conversation takes to Paying it some interest From time to time Inside all that greatness In all of your adventures You're all alone Hold up, hold up, baby I can't sit beside
inside you while you're going on about your simple life nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different you this floor was gross it was so it's <laughs> so gross it I, I clean it all the time but it just gets so messy so easily and on this particular day my kids had pop tarts and I don't even buy pop tarts because they crumble them up and they just make such a mess with them but there is a lunch bus that is delivering food to all the kids in our neighborhood and in our town which is really such a blessing and so amazing and it's so much fun for the kids to go out there and get lunch but they've been delivering like they deliver lunch and they deliver breakfast for the next day for the kids so a lot of days they will um, make they'll pack pop tarts for the kids and um yeah so my kids love pop tarts but they like i think playing with them more than they like eating them and there was just like chunks of the inside of pop tarts on the floor so i honestly could not wait to get this mop out and just get this floor cleaned um this is a newer mop i bought it a few weeks ago and i put the water in it literally takes like 30 seconds to heat up so i was just cleaning the fridge and letting that heat up and you can see the steam in the side of the video um, already popping out and it just gets these floors so clean this is not like sponsored or anything like that I just it's honestly made life a lot easier in this house because trying to mop with a mop and bucket and going back and forth with it was just like so hard on my back and it was time-consuming and this this mop is just like it's so easy like I it's like vacuuming you know what I mean like it doesn't hurt my back it sanitizes the floor it's just really it's just really made things easier and um, like right here I had to push down a little bit with my foot but that that was the pop tart that was like really caked onto the floor but it came right up I was just a little pressure on the mop and I was able to get it right up so I'm very thankful for this Thing. It's just made, <laughs> it's made my life a lot easier. been watching for a while you know that I love lighting candles they just they make my house feel so warm and relaxing and I just love the smell of the candles so I always am lighting candles if it's cloudy out or rainy out especially like even in the morning I will light all the candles in my house and it just makes it feel very cozy and warm
I have this random mirror out in my like foyer area and this actually doesn't belong here. It goes in my bedroom, but I work out every day in this spot and that is why I have the mirror there because it helps me to work out. Like I like having a mirror so I can see like my form and if I'm doing it right because um, I don't ever want to hurt myself. So that's why that's there and that's why I'm kind of putting it away. So I need to just buy a mirror that I can use right there. That would make more sense so I don't have to keep moving it back and forth every day. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please um, follow me on Instagram. I love posting like stories and pictures and just basically whatever we're doing in the day, I kind of post over there. Um, I like to do get ready with me's and sometimes I do some cleaning in my Insta stories. So definitely go check me out over there. And if you're not subscribed to my channel here, subscribe. I would love to have you a part of my family. We just hit 8,000 today. So I'm super excited. I can't wait to get to like 50,000. <laughs> that would be so amazing. It is so hard growing your channel on YouTube. Um, it's just, it is so much work. So I am so thankful for you guys. And I appreciate all of you that share my videos. It just honestly means the world to me. So I hope you are having an amazing day. I hope you're not stressed out. I hope you're doing exactly what you want to do today. And I will see you in the next video. Bye guys. To hit my phone up None of that pretentious life No, 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 don't need no pills To get high, there's no doubt In my mind, your loving Is all that I need